exclusives right here on CNBC TV 18. So here's another one. We start on the joint venture company between Tata Sons and Singapore Airlines is all set to fly overseas from the twin from June 2018, by which time it will have at least 20 aircrafts in its fleet from the current 11. In an interview to CNBC TV 18's Rona Joe Banerjee, Vistara CEO Fee you said that the company is finalizing its India and overseas strategy, which will be presented to the board very shortly. He expects a big capital infusion into the airline from Tata's and Singapore Airlines once the board approves the plan. We have 11 aircraft in our fleet today, uh, with two more uh, slated to join uh, the fleet in October this year. So uh, by the end of this year, we would have 13 aircraft, and these are all the CEOs, the current engine options for the A320 aircraft. The first of our uh, NEOS aircraft, which is the uh, new engine option, is slated to be delivered from uh, June 2017 and we would have uh, achieved a full 20 uh, aircraft uh, fleet size by June 2018, a good two years away from today. As you rightly said, Mr. Yo, like international plans will require a different strategy altogether because you'll be obviously competing with the big names. So are there plans of also get entering into some sort of a code share pact like we've seen other airlines do? In terms of going to code sharing, uh, it was uh, uh, clarified finally in the, through the aviation policy that uh, at last uh, Vistara will be able to uh, undertake what we call the domestic code share, uh, something that uh, you know, we, we have been getting a lot of requests from the major foreign carriers who are eagerly looking forward to not just partnering Vistara but also deepening their partnership with Vistara. Okay, so by June 2018, Vistara is all set to fly internationally and that's something that uh, most airline players have been looking at doing and Vistara can finally now reach the next leg of growth. We'll take a very short